the pandemic has brought a value to a whole lot of things that we have taken for granted. And one of these is the webcam. And if you're in New Zealand or Australia, you probably have come across this product, the Gorilla Gaming HD Stream Webcam 1080p. Today, we're going to unbox and review this webcam and see if this is actually a worthy product. But before that, a word from our sponsor. Sick and tired of that activate Windows watermark? Head down to u2key.com. u2key.com sells legit Windows 10 keys. Enter my promo code OPC24 and this will give you an additional 24% discount, bringing it down to a low price of $12. They also have Microsoft Office 2019 and using the same promo code, you'll get it for only $41. Now that's an amazing deal. They also have other software and the code in the screen to get these discounts. They accept all major credit cards and other payment options, including Bitcoin. Once again, that's u2key.com, a proud sponsor of OVC PC. Links are in the description below. Now back to the video. So recently I have been doing a lot of work from home and because of this I needed a decent webcam for my setup. My company did give me a laptop but I don't really use it as it is very limiting especially when you're opening a, a whole lot of spreadsheets. So I thought hey maybe I need to buy a webcam so I could use it for work and maybe when I'm doing some streaming tests for our channel. So like everyone else I tried to look it up on price buy. I tried to see what's out there. There were a few webcams that caught my attention but I didn't really pursue this because after looking at the reviews it wasn't really good value. And I didn't really want to pay anything over 100 New Zealand dollars as I'm not going to be using this for full time work and I'm not a streamer. However, this has caught my eyes. The Guerrilla Gaming HD Stream Webcam 1080p which retails at $99. They did have a cheaper $49 version, but hey, I was like, hey, let's just go for that $99, it might be better. So like everyone else, I went to the internet and see if there are actually reviews of this product and there wasn't any at all. I tried reaching out to Gorilla Gaming, which is owned by Mighty Ape, to seek more information about the device. I didn't really get much information. I wanted to do some video shots. You know, I wanted video shots of day and night from their webcam if they have anything on their archives or any promotional videos. But, you know, they couldn't give me anything. I asked about low light performance, etc. But their chat support eventually said that after discussing with their gaming team, they recommended other products, not this product. So I was like, eh, hmm. Now, I know Gorilla Gaming and I know their values. If you look at their websites, one of their values is actually to maintain high standards. So I was like, hey, they, if they put their name on something, they must have like really, well, good standards. So I did ask like Gorilla Gaming, hey, if I'm going to buy this um, webcam and it doesn't perform good, can I return this and can I have a refund? And they assured me that if I'm not satisfied with the product, I could return it. So I was like, hey, what the hell, let's just do it. So I finally got this product and here's the package. Let's do a quick unboxing. Here's the box with the Gorilla Gaming HG Stream webcam. Got more like the features on the back. The cereals there. Well, barcodes there. And that's the, the top portion of the package. Let's open it up. And here we have... Yep, USB, standard USB. And the webcam. We also have a um, one page manual for the webcam. Doesn't really give you anything more like just requirements, uh, things to caution and stuff like that. Here's what the webcam looks like. Okay, here we go. Let's get that. Yep, that's the one. It's got a privacy thing there. You could 
switch off the webcam. And you've got this one here. And you've got that hole ready for any tripod. So, and you could um, open that one, turn it around. Pretty flexible. Yep, and let's say the privacy shield or something. Yeah, you could flick it to the right to uh, open the camera, and flick it back to uh, close the webcam. Comes with those two microphones on both sides. One thing I found really annoying when I was unboxing this one is the plastic films. They are really hard to come off. So yeah, but everything else was fine. Installation of the device is easy. It's basically a plug and play. It gets picked up by the system without any issues at all. Even OBS just picks it up easy. Now we're going to do some video test with this webcam. We're going to be doing this in different scenarios, both during the day and at night. And this is with or without the selfie LED lights, All right? So this is the night test with just the room lights on. This is the night test with the room lights on and the selfie LED light on as well. This is the night test with the room lights off but with the selfie LED light on. This is the night test with both room lights and selfie LED light turned off. This is the day test inside a dark room with just the selfie LED light on. This is a day test with a well lighted room. And this is the day test with a well lighted room with our selfie LED light on. Okay, this is a sound check, a microphone test for the Gorilla Gaming webcam. Once again, this is a microphone test for the Gorilla Gaming streaming webcam. One, two, three, four. So overall, the webcam is pretty good for its price. Its performance on well-lighted settings is good and decent. However, when you are in very low light scenarios or settings, and like what we have in our night days without the selfie LED light on, it's very poor. So would I recommend this webcam? For streamers, I would highly recommend that you put some good background lighting or you know make your settings well lighted if you are planning to buy this for everyday use yes this is an excellent webcam microphone is okay for general usage as well and if you wanted to check this webcam out in action i have a simulated streaming test run video using this webcam on this video here and, and that's it for this video. If you've made it this far, please consider liking the video and subscribing to our channel. It really helps us a lot with the YouTube algorithm. Thanks again for watching and see you in the next video.